Hi, today I'm reviewing the Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Glow Highlighter. And really quick, I just want to say I purchased all these products with my own money so you know you can trust my opinion is what I honestly believe. And this is the full size, which is 0.68 ounces, and it sells for $25, which is almost a bargain in my opinion for something like this. There's a lot of uh, people making the liquid highlighters. Uh, Cover FX kind of came out with the first really spectacular ones. And Anastasia Beverly Hills is getting into the game now. And she has four different colors. The color I selected was Peach Fizz, which is translated into Golden Copper. And I am loving these. It's I, First of all, I love the container. The Cover FX ones, I always had issues with kind of spillage and it being very messy and also very tough to clean up. So I love this packaging because it's very difficult to spill and make a big mess with it. So let me give you a swatch in there. So many different ways you can use this product. So you can see the uh, liquid copper there and it is highly pigmented, that's for sure, but it's very creamy. It's not necessarily a liquid per se. It's more of kind of a, a gel texture, which I love, but you can definitely mix this into a primer for like kind of a little light glow on your face or you could also mix it into your foundation if you want a little bit more of a glow or you could also layer it after your foundation and layer it on top on your cheekbones or on your um, brow bones so you can definitely get more intense glow you can kind of customize it I guess that's why I love these so if you just want something very uh, more muted mix it in with your primer a little bit more of a glow mix it in with your foundation and if you really want some intense glow just put it on your cheekbones on top of your foundation um, this is an awesome product and I like her formula and the fact that she didn't include any fragrance ingredients so if you have sensitive skin you're less likely likely to have issues with it um, some of the products there's a lot of companies that will mix sent in with everything so I love that she didn't include that in here and you almost can't even feel like you have it on so I've also had success layering it after powder after my setting powder and it didn't clump or anything like that and it definitely lasts all day I haven't had any issues with it flaking off during the day it's definitely a nice gel formula not not a liquid more of a gel which is in my opinion a great thing so this is definitely a nice product that she's come out with. I definitely think I'm going to be checking out some of the other colors. So she's got a few other colors. Perla, which is a champagne platinum. And she's also got uh, oyster, which is a lighter color, sparkling rose gold. And then bronzed, which is described as metallic amber. So perhaps if you're a little darker skin tone, that might work well for you. But I definitely think I'm going to be checking these out because I think $25 for this product is kind of a bargain in my opinion so this is definitely worth checking out if you liked the cover FX uh, enhance if you like the cover FX glow this is definitely worth checking out just it's much less messier so definitely check this out I love this product so and I wasn't paid to say this and I wasn't given the product to say that so for me I'm gonna give this two thumbs up and I'm interested if you guys have had a chance to try this or what is your favorite highlighter? Do you wear highlighters? Do you use powder highlighters, liquid highlighters, uh, cream highlighters? I'm kind of interested to hear from you. I love hearing from you guys. You guys always have good tips and tricks and you guys, I love hearing from you. So leave a comment and also feel free to subscribe. I come out with at least one new review every single day. Thank you guys.